Hi friends, welcome to this session and in this video we'll learn how to push images to Docker Hub. Docker Hub is a public cloud image repository or you can call it as a registry where we can push all our images. You can also create a private registry okay? and we'll see how in our next session. But for now, if you don't have an account, so then create a Docker Hub account and it's very simple and straight to create the account. Once you're done, then we are ready to push the images. So let's go to our command terminal and see what are the images that we have created from our previous sessions. So we have all these images. Let's start with let's start with hello world and try to push this image. And the steps will remain the same for all other images. Okay. So first thing is once you create the account in Docker Hub, let's try to log in through command terminal. And the command is Docker login. And this will prompt you for the username and the username I am using is gain it can and then it will prompt you for the password and the login is success. Now let's look at the command that we can use to push. Okay. So if you look at the help and you can see that there is a command called push which is used to push an image or a repository to a registry. So let's try to use that docker image push followed by the name of the repository that is hello world. So let's see what happens. Okay, we got an error that says authentication required and it also says layer already exists. And if you see that it is trying to push to docker.io that is something called a docker hub to that is trying to push to the library account the hello world and we where it says it already exists so by default what is it is trying to do is it is trying to push to something that we don't have access to the reason why is it is using a standard format here the push uh, the command is trying to use the format that is something like this okay first thing is it is the registry here we are we logged in uh, to docker hub so it is using docker.io okay and next is the user account or the user id that you have logged into okay and then followed by the image repo now if you look at here we don't specify the username when we we are trying to push the hello world right if you look at here we are just pushing the hello world so and what it's trying to do is it's trying to push it to the docker hub okay uh, so we need to what we need to do is we need to format this to the standard you know format so let's see how we can do that First thing is I need to rename my repository from hello world to the user account slash hello world. Okay. So how we can do that? If you see, we don't have anything that says rename. Okay. But we have something called tag that is used to create a tag. So let's see how we can create that means how can we create an image using tag. So Docker image tag followed by the image ID and it is here BF75, BF75. Then the name of the user that is gain ID yeah, slash hello world. Okay. Now you can see, let's now look at the images you can see that there are two image id with the same same ids and we can now remove the one that says hello world by using remove command docker image rm hello world okay so it's untagged now if you try to list it again so now we have only one image so now let's try to push it again docker image push 
and this time I'm going to give the username in it can yes and slash hello world and hit enter and now you see the registry the repository it says docker.io instead of library now it is the username and then the repository name so now if you go to the docker hub initially we had nothing now if you refresh and you can see that we have hello world that is publicly available so that is how you can push your images to docker hub and we can continue the same steps for all these images and push all our images to docker hub that's all for this video and i will see you in the next session